In this experiment, I will show finding the conductivity of different solutions. Background information of the experiment. Solutions that has ability to conduct electricity are called conductor or electrolytes, while the solutions that don't conduct electricity are called bad conductors or non-electrolytes. We will check the conductivity of different solutions like salt, sodium hydroxide, sugar, HCl, vinegar and water. You need two electrodes, copper and the zinc electrode and two colored connecting wires. These are two red color connecting wires and a bulb which should have uh, two terminals as you can see here and another wire which is black in color. Operator setting. Now connect one terminal of the black colored wire with the terminal of the battery that is black in color and the other end of that wire with the zinc electrode. Be careful while connecting the wires and switch off the battery before all this process. Now take the other wire which is red in color and connect it with the terminal of the battery which is also red in color. Now connect the other end of that wire with the terminal of the bulb. Take another wire and the other terminal of the bulb. Connect one end of that wire. Be careful and uh, the other end of that wire connect it with the copper electrode. Be careful while setting the apparatus. Here are two electrodes. This is the final look of the apparatus. You can see the connection between the wires and the terminals of battery and the bulb. Remember, connect the wire which is black in color to the terminal of the battery which is also black in color and the wire which is red in color connect to the terminal of the battery which is also red in color. Dip the electrodes in all the solution one by one starting with water. As you can see here there is no glow in the bulb. So water is not a conductor. Now the sugar. Now you can see there is no glow in bulb. So it is also a bad conductor. Sodium hydroxide. Now bulb is glowing which indicates that sodium hydroxide is a good conductor. Look at C. Now dip in NaCl salt solution. As you can see bulb is again glowing. It means that salt is also a good conductor. Now finally in vinegar. You can see it's creating dim light which indicates that it is an electrolyte but it is a weak electrolyte because there is difficulty in glowing. So vinegar is not a good conductor. Don't forget to wash the electrodes every time before putting in all the solutions. Results of the experiment shows that salt, HCl, sodium hydroxide are strong electrolyte while sugar and water are non-electrolytes and vinegar is a weak electrolyte because it produces less glow. If you have any question dear students then you can please ask in the comment section. Stay healthy, stay aware. Remember me in your prayers. If you find this video helpful, then this video must deserve a like. Thanks for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe the channel.